Activate Flippy Station. It's time, get up and shout. I wonder what we'll learn about Flippy Wonders. Race you to the ball pit. Okay, Blippi, huddle ball, activate. <laughs> Whoa, silly somersaults. Totally awesome, Debo. Huh? <gasps> Is that a puppy? I love puppies! Hey, it's me, Blippi, and this is Debo and Blue. What's your name? Lily! What a cute name! Great idea, Lily! <laughs> Blippi, Lily wants you to throw the ball for us. Okay, Lily and Blue, are you ready? Yes, yes, yes! <laughs> Go fetch! <laughs> Look at how fast Lily's tail is wagging. Hmm, I wonder, why do dogs wag their tails? <laughs> Uh-oh, I think Debo's broken. <sighs> Oh no! Lily's probably scared. Debo, try giving her a treat. Now hold out your paw so she can sniff you and know you're a friend. Yeah, Lily! All better. Do you want me to throw the ball again? Excited! Ready? Go! Fetch! Oh, she's so happy! Too hard, Blue! Oh no! Is Debo okay? <laughs> Debo, you're all better! <laughs> Hugs? <laughs> <laughs> Not so hard, Blue. <laughs> Good girl, Lily. <laughs> Good girl. She's so cute. Hugs? Be gentle, Blue. Oh, yes, right. <laughs> Hey, look at how fast her tail is wagging. Yeah, dogs wag their tails as a way of showing emotion, like fear or, or excitement. <laughs> Just like my antennas glow different colors for all my different feelings. I got the answer to my question. Why do dogs wag their tails? Dogs wag their tails to show emotions like fear or excitement. Upload answer, Debo. <laughs> <laughs> Good girl, Lily. Good girl. <laughs> Whoa! That was a gigantic truck. You're right, Debo. I think that was a monster truck. Hmm, I wonder, what makes a monster truck special? Good idea! We can catch up with that monster truck and find out! I'm gonna need monster truck wheels! Monster truck wheels confirmed. Activate Flippy Station! <laughs> Debo? <laughs> Whoa, Debo! You have the monster truck wheels attachment? <laughs> You're like a monster truck! All right, let's ride! Debo the monster truck is ready for adventure! Crash! Crash! <laughs> hey, it's me, Blippi, and this is Debo! You really crushed that car! Hi, Blippi, I'm Megan. 
So Megan, we're here to find out what makes a monster truck special. Cool. Well, I think the best way to answer your question is to show you what I do. Great! You see, I'm a monster truck with big, tall monster tires. I'm 13 feet tall! Wow! Let's do this! All right! <laughs> huh? Huh? Crash! We can't bounce as high as you, Megan! And oh boy, we're almost tipping over! Well, I have heavy duty suspension, which are special springs, so I can bounce way up and down and not tumble over. <laughs> I use them when I race and have competitions. Cool! Whoa! Whoa! Yeah! Welcome aboard, Flippy! Buckle up! It's time to dominate the obstacle course! Whoa! 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 This is awesome! How can you turn and zigzag so fast? I have something called four-wheel steering, so I can turn all four wheels at once, instead of just two wheels like a lot of regular trucks. Us monster trucks are built for short, high-powered bursts of speed! I nailed that! Megan, that was amazing! And I have the answer to my question. What makes a monster truck special? Monster trucks are a special kind of truck with big tires, heavy duty suspension, and four wheel steering. Upload answer, Devo. Bye, Megan. It was so cool to ride with you. Bye, Blippi. Keep on crushing. <laughs> Fun in the sun? Here we come! Good idea, Tabs! I should put some sunscreen on first. Oh no! I can't find it! Hmm, I wonder, why do I have to wear sunscreen? Oh no! Is it really that important? What are we gonna do? Your super sunscreen to the rescue! Whoa! Hola, amigos! That means hello, friends. Hey, it's me, Blippi, and this is Tabs. Here, Blippi, hold out your hands. Okay. Even though sunlight is good for you, we need to make sure you're protected. Perfecto, Blippi! All right. Now we can finally have some fun in the sun. Uh-oh. Hey there, Boom. Blippi, you can't go play yet. You missed the spot. Huh? How can you tell? Here, look through these special sunglasses I made. Whoa! Cool! That's the sunscreen working to protect you. The sun gives off extra strong beams of light called ultraviolet rays. Even though you can't see ultraviolet rays, too much can cause a sunburn. What's this spot? That's the spot you missed. I hold out your hand, Bleepy. All right. Oh, no. That person missed a spot, too. We must protect them with sunscreen. To the Blippi Mobile. Go, Blippi, go! I'm gonna need helicopter blades and the harness. Helicopter blades, harness confirmed. Shrinking down! The Blippi Mobile is ready for adventure. Whoppa! Save that sunbather from sunburn! All right, Tabs. Let's protect some skin. Senor Super Sunscreen to the rescue! More to the right, Tabs! Now left! We 
We did it! Rowing up! Weppa! Nice job, Bleepy! Thanks for a super adventure, Senior Super Sunscreen. And I got the answer to my question. Why do I have to wear sunscreen? I have to wear sunscreen because it protects our skin from the ultraviolet light of the sun, which can cause sunburn. Upload answer tabs. Now, who's up for some fun in the sun? Yeah! Okay, Babel. I spy with my little eye something that starts with J. Plenty of sea creatures start with J. Jackfish, jelly nose fish, even jewelfish. Not now, Tabs. I'm looking for a jayfish. Oh, it's jellyfish. <laughs> okay, Tabs. Your turn. I spy a dolphin. Listen. She's trying to communicate with us. Hmm. I wonder. How do dolphins communicate? Follow! Pursue! Chase! Here we come, little dolphin! Ooh. Whoa! It's so murky! It's murky and hard to see because of all the sand floating in the water! Whoa! Look out! Whoa! Uh-oh! <laughs> hey there, Blippi! Oh, hey, Larry! This is Babble and Tabs! Sorry we bonked into you! That's all right! It's all this sand floating around! Well, I'm off to get my teeth cleaned! <laughs> See you later! Buh bye bye How can the dolphins see in this murky water? Think, think, think! Oh, I know! The dolphin is using echolocation. Echo what? Echolocation. It's how some animals like dolphins and bats see objects by reflecting sound off them. Oh, yeah. I'm going to need echolocation. Echolocation confirmed. Incredible. Amazing. Awesome. We should try making clicks like the dolphin. Look! The sound waves from the clicks are bouncing off the objects and coming back to us with information about how far and how big the objects are. Hey! There's the dolphin! We found her! Wait! Come back! I didn't get to say hello! That's it! The dolphin is using a signature whistle to tell you her name. Try mimicking her signature whistle to call her back. All right. She understood me. Hey. It's me, Blippi, and this is Tabs and Babble. I think she wants to know your signature whistle so she can say your name in her language. Hmm. How about... Oh, what an amazing underwater adventure! And I got the answer to my question. How do dolphins communicate? Dolphins communicate with their signature whistles and chirps. And they can also use clicks to navigate and tell what's ahead. Upload answer tabs. Yes, precisely correct. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> I'm in the lead. Ah, baby chick straight ahead. Change course. Silly somersault. Hey, it's me, Blippi. And this is Mika and Tabs. Hi, I'm Penelope. Can you help me? I think I'm lost. Good question, Tabs. I wonder. How can we help Penelope find her way home? What's the last thing you remember, Penelope? All I remember is following a rainbow leaf. And now I'm here.
Great thinking, Tabs. We should shrink down to Penelope's size so we can see things like she does. Shrinking down! Look! Penelope's footprints! Let's retrace her steps. <laughs> I found you, Rainbow Leaf! Hey, Penelope! Wait for us! That's a butterfly. <laughs> a butterfly? Oh. Penelope, does any of this look familiar to you? Um, no. But I do remember a forest of yellow suns. Blippi, look! That's it! Oh, you mean yellow sunflowers, Penelope. Penelope? Uh. <laughs> <laughs> it's so pretty up here. We made it! Mini celebration dance! Can you see your house from here, Penelope? No, but I remember something. A field of black and white clouds. I hear cows mooing over there. Oh, Penelope, those aren't black and white clouds. They're cows. <laughs> oh! That looks like fun! <laughs> Come on! The cows are this way. That was fun! Hey, Tabs! Tag! You're it! Oh, no. Not again. <laughs> oh, wow! Woohoo! And I got the answer to my question. How can we help Penelope find her way home? We helped Penelope find her way home by using our eyes and ears to observe the environment around us. Upload answer tabs. Ooh, a fuzzy, fuzzy, wuzzy. <laughs> Bye, Penelope. Wow. Look at those birds! Oh! Wow! Look at all these animals we're finding! Maybe we'll find the king of the jungle next! Ah! <gasps> That's not the king of the jungle! King of the jungle? Wait, are, are you looking for a lion? There's not really any lions in the jungle. You gotta go to the savanna for that. Out there! Hmm, I wonder. Why are lions called the king of the jungle? Whoa! <laughs> Lion! Cool! Hey, it's me, Blippi. And this is Tabs. Hello, Blippi and Tabs. I'm Jabari, the king of the jungle. I was just sharpening my kingly skills on the lion obstacle course. The lion obstacle course? That's so cool! Would you like to train with me? If you complete the course, I'll make you honorary lions! Yeah! <laughs> Our first lesson is here, where you will learn to sneak like a lion. Sneak like a lion. Got it. Shh. Not so loud, Blippi. You will scare off the prey. The prey? The prey is the butterfly. Oh, I get it. Sneaky. Ow! <laughs> Not bad for a first try. Yeah! Let's try the next lesson. Jumping! Crouch down and feel your energy. Then, when you are ready, release the energy and jump! Are you ready, Tabs? Jump like a lion! 
Yes! Great job! Now there's one more lesson. Hop on my back and hang on tight! Yay! Ooh. Welcome to the Roaring Arena! To roar like a lion, follow along. First, find your power. Lift up and roar! Way to go, Blippi and Tabs! You are now honorary lions. Roar! Thanks, Jabari. We had so much fun. And I got the answer to my question. Why are lions called the king of the jungle? Even though lions are called king of the jungle, they actually live on the savanna. Lions are sneaky hunters, big jumpers, and have really loud roars. Upload answer tabs. See you next time we're in the savanna, Jabari. Goodbye, Blippi and Tabs. Come back and roar with me anytime. Debate Blippi Station. It's time, get up and shout. I wonder what we'll learn about. Blippi Wonders. <laughs> Whoa, what a beautiful day. Blippi. Did you know that today is Earth Day? I didn't. Hmm, I wonder, how do you celebrate Earth Day? Let's sing a song and find out. Look at what it's worth to live on planet Earth. It's the place that we call home. Yeah, it's pretty great. We're the buzzing of the bees, the wind blowing through the trees. It's the place that we call home. And, and we, we must protect it. What can we do to help the Earth? I'm glad you asked, actually. Hit it! Instead of throwing this away, we can make it into a house where a bird can stay. Tweet, tweet, little birdie. Here's a new home for you. <laughs> Wait! Before you throw that in the trash, give it to me, and in a flash, I'll, I'll fix, fix it up for you. you. It's brand new. Helping Earth is what we have. Protect the Earth. We can sort the trash into different bins. Bottles, cans, and cardboard. Yeah, throw them in. Sort them out. Recycling is what it's all about. Woohoo! Don't forget the buzzy, buzzy bees. We need them to pollinate the flowers, don't you see? So the plants can grow. Come on, little bees, this way. <laughs> when it's the home for you. What are you doing, Mika? I'm planting a tree. See, the world is full of plants, flowers, and trees. Yeah. The plants help the earth breathe. <laughs> when it's the home for you and me, planet Earth is the place to be. Is it, Blippi? Exactly! We share our home with so many different animals. And we need to keep the Earth healthy and happy so all the animals can be happy and healthy, too. From the elephants on the savannah to the polar bears at the North Pole the monkeys in the jungle Yeah, we all call the Earth our home when it's the home for you. we call home. Let's see what's inside. 
The Great Big Book of Curiosity? Whoa! What a curious kind of treasure. Huh? Yeah! Whee! Whee! Yay! Whoa! Hey, it's me, Blippi. And this is Mika, Debo, and Tabs. <laughs> hmm, I wonder, who were they? We better go find out. Hey, Blippi! Mika! Over here! Can you help us? We'd love to help. The name's Boom. We're looking for something that we need, but we can't remember what it's called. And I'm Benjamin. The thing we need is kind of shaped like this, but with a less bouncy stick. Whoa! Whoa! Boom's away! Whoa! And it's frozen, like this. I'll get you out, Debo. Looks like you gotta shake it up. Oh, yeah. Shake it up. Whoa! Purple! No. Yellow! No. Oh, hi, Blippi and Mika. I'm Barry. Can you help me find something? <laughs> sure. We would love to help. It's usually red. Red. Got it. But it can also be purple. Or orange. Green. Or every color. Whoa! <laughs> What's that? Hey! <laughs> Hello! I'm Blue. I need the yummy for my tummy. You're looking for something that tastes good. It's a yummy and makes me feel happy inside. Oh, no! Hugs? <laughs> What's that? No, it's not that. Not that either. Was it... Boomsicle? Whoa! <laughs> oh, yay! Flippy and Mika. I'm Babel. Can you help me find this word? Let's sound it out. Something... Sickle? Tricycle? Bicycle? Whamsicle? <laughs> Good idea, Tabs. Let's review our notes. It's rectangular and has a stick. It's frozen. It could be any color. It makes you feel happy. And it sounds like something sickle. Hmm, this is tricky. Popsicles! <laughs> you were looking for popsicles. Yeah! yeah! Hey, who are you all? Boom! Benjamin, Barry, Blue, Babble! And we are the Curiosity Crew. Wow! I got the answer to my question. Who were they? They are my new friends, the Curiosity Crew. Upload answer, Debo. <laughs> Woohoo! <All right! laughs> Activate Flippy Station. It's time, get up and shout. I wonder what we'll learn about Blippi. Whoa, look at that, Tabs. It's an adorable kitty cat. <laughs> and look at those super long whiskers. Hmm, I wonder, why do cats have whiskers? Great idea, Tabs. Let's follow that kitty cat and find out. I'm gonna need wings. Wings confirmed. Activate Flippy Station. Shrinking down! The Flippy Mobile is ready for adventure. Do you see any kitties yet, Tabs? Whoa! What was that? Hey! It's me, Blippi! 
What's your name? Hit please the name and treats are my game. Say, you aren't holding out on me, are you? <laughs> holding out on what? Shh. Treats. I can smell them like hot cakes in the morning. They're close. Hurry, follow me. Wait for me. land so perfectly. My whiskers have special sensors that help keep me oriented, so I always land on my feet. Like this. Aha. Do you think you can fit? My whiskers help me determine if I can fit through the passage without getting stuck. See? I told you. <clears throat> Come on, Blippi. It's so dark. How can you see anything? When I can't see what's around me, my whiskers tell me when something's there. Ah, oh, rats. No treats in here. But we must be close. Come on, y'all. What else can your whiskers do? Even the slightest breeze can tell me information about my environment and what direction a smell is coming from. My whiskers are telling me that the treats are... Woo! There! Woo! Jackpot! <laughs> Would you look at that? Woo-hoo-hoo! I'm happier than a pig in mud! What a great adventure, Kipley! We found the treats! And I got the answer to my question. Why do cats have whiskers? Cats' whiskers help them navigate their environment and help them keep oriented so they always land on their feet. Upload answer tabs. Bye-bye, Kipley! Thanks, Bliffy. It was great to have you as a sidekick on this adventure. Bye, y'all! Activate Blippi Station! It's time to get up and shout. I wonder what we'll learn about Blippi! Whoa! Look! A bird flying at night! Huh, it's a bat! Hmm, I wonder, how do bats fly in the dark? Good idea, Debo. Let's take flight in the night. I'm going to need wings and spider legs. Wings, spider legs. Confirmed. Activate Blippi Station. Shrinking down! The Blippi Mobile is ready for adventure. Whoa, whose lights are those? Hey, it's me, Blippi. I put my bright headlights on to find you. Oh, hey, Bliffy. I'm Matt the Bat. I was just heading out to fly my favorite flying course. You want to join me? Sure. I was wondering how bats fly in the dark. I can show you. But one thing, Blippy. No headlights. Got it. Let's go. Whoa! It's so dark. Twigs! Crunch! Look out! Whoa! Flippy, didn't you hear that tree? No, I didn't. Wait, did you say hear the tree? Yeah, I can hear everything in my way. Heads up, rocks! Whoa! How do you do that? Bats have a special skill called echolocation. I make sounds and they bounce off objects and echo so I can tell where the objects are and how far away I am from them. Really, Debo? You have echolocation too? Because you're a robot dog? <laughs> well, let's use it. Whoa! Let's fly! Whoa! 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 Whoa. Whoa. Wow! Yeah, wee! <sighs> nice flying, guys. Thanks! And I have the answer to my question. How do bats fly in the dark? Echolocation! 
bats make high-pitched sounds that bounce off objects and echo so they can safely hear where they're at in the dark. Upload answer, Debo. Oh, look, it's bedtime. Fun flying with you, Blippi and Debo. Uh, uh, uh. You sleep upside down? Whoa! Bats are amazing! Bye-bye, Matt the Bat! Activate Blippi Station! It's time, get up and shout. I wonder what we'll learn about Blippi! Easy. Careful now. Oh, I'm hungry! Ah, oh, this cereal is soggy! Hmm, I wonder, why does cereal get soggy? Great idea, Debo! We'll shrink down and find out! I'm gonna need wings, duck feet, and the grabber arm! Wings, duck feet, grabber arm, confirmed. Activate Flippy Station! <laughs> Ready for adventure! You're right, Diva! It sure is hard! Attention! Whoa! Huh? Who are you? I'm Scooper the Spoon! That's Sergeant Scoop of the Spoon to you. Hey, it's me, Blippi, and this is Devo. We're here to learn why cereal gets soggy. Well, you came to the best of the best. These crunchy pieces of cereal are as hard as nails. The only problem is we got incoming milk in T minus 30 seconds. What huh? happens then? The cereal gets all wet, Blippi. At first, it may seem like cereal is 100% solid, but if you look closely, it's actually porous. That means full of Tiny little holes. Good idea, Debo. I'll go gather some intel, and you stay here on the lookout. Shrinking down again! It's like a cave made of cereal. All those holes you're flying through are open space for milk to fill and make the cereal soggy. Then it expands and falls huh? apart. Milk in command! Whoa! The cereal is falling apart! Time to get out of here! Growing up! No time to float around! We've got a cereal rescue mission to huh? complete! Now that the milk has infiltrated the cereal, we've got to scoop fast before the cereal gets soggy. We're on it. Oh no! I got it! You see, in the few minutes the cereal has been in milk, it has absorbed the liquid through the hole. A lot like how a sponge absorbs water. With your help, we got all the cereal out safely. Well done, troops. Thanks, Sergeant Scooper. And I got the answer to my question. Why does cereal get soggy? Cereal gets soggy when milk fills in the tiny holes of the cereal and causes it to expand and fall apart. Upload answer, Debo. Goodbye, Blippi. Bye-bye, Sergeant Scooper. Thanks for the scoop. Are you ready, Mika? Yeah, Blippi! Let's go! <laughs> Four, three, two, one! Do you wanna have some fun? Let's have fun in the sun, fun in the sun! Yeah, yeah, yeah! Let's have fun in the sun, fun in the sun! Hey, hey, hey! Let's have fun in the sun, fun in the sun! Sun, fun in the sun. Hey, hey, hey! Summer is here, let's go and play. I wonder what fun we'll have today. Let's play catch with a ball and glove. Summer is the season that I love. We can splash 
in the swimming pool. Come on, Blue, you can join in too. I'm excited, I can't wait. Just remember to hydrate. Let's have fun in the sun, fun in the sun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's have fun in the sun, fun in the sun. Hey, hey, hey. Let's have fun in the sun, fun in the sun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's have fun in the sun, fun in the sun. Hey, Miss Sun, let's have some fun. Eating ice cream when the weather's hot. Please be careful or it will drop. The crew's eating popsicles, one for me, please. Whoa. Oh no, watch out! Boom's got a brain freeze. I like two scoops on my ice cream cone for Debo too, instead of a phone. I'm excited, I can't wait. Just remember to hydrate. Let's have fun in the sun, fun in the sun. Yeah, yeah, yeah! Let's have fun in the sun, fun in the sun. Oh, hey there, sun. Hey there, Blippi. When you're shining, it's so much fun. Hmm, I wonder, how do you shine so bright? Well, I'm actually a big ball of gas, which creates a lot of energy, both heat and light. Wow, that's so interesting. Okay, upload, answer Debo, and let's go. <laughs> Driving around in the Blippi mobile, me and Debo. Behind the wheel, fun in the sun, playing on our speakers, wind in our hair, and feeling the beat. Yeah, summer is my favorite time of year. The sun shines bright and the sky is clear. I'm excited, I can't wait. Just remember to hydrate. Let's have fun in the sun, fun in the sun. This is so much yeah, fun. Yeah, yeah. Let's have fun in the sun, fun in the sun. We can dig the pool with hey, our hey, excavator. Hey. Let's have fun in the sun, fun in the sun. Hey there, sun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Let's have fun in the sun, fun in the sun. Game is sun, it's been so fun. Bye bye uh. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Excuse me. That was a big... Hmm, I wonder, why do people burp? Oh, I can tell you, but it's more fun to show you! Off to the nearest mouth! All right, I'm gonna need frog legs. Frog legs confirmed. Shrinking down! The Flippy Mobile is ready for adventure! <laughs> Whoa! Well, that was fun. Debo, you can open your eyes now. I think it's over. Here we go again! Yeah! <laughs> Whoa! I'm gonna need monkey arms. Monkey arms confirmed. Whoa! 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 What's that? It's called the esophagus. We all have them. It's a long tube that connects the throat to the stomach. Woo! Esophagus. That's a fun word. E soph a gus. <coughs> Whoa! He's coughing up a storm. <laughs> oh, yeah. These are ideal conditions for a big old. So cool! Careful! The bubble's delicate and can explode at any moment! <laughs> yes, get it! Get it, Bob! Whee! <laughs> oh, 
yeah! The bubble is all the extra air that this guy swallowed! It's like a trampoline! Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Uh-oh, too much bouncing! It's gonna blow! Whoa, -hoo -hoo -hoo. The air bubble is rising up the esophagus and toward the mouth! <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, yeah! Experiment complete! <laughs> that was so fun! And I got the answer to my question. Why do people burp? People burp when they swallow too much air and it builds up inside the esophagus. The body gets rid of the air by burping. <laughs> Upload answer, Debo. I think it's time to dance! Boom, cha, cha, boom, cha, cha, boom. Let's boom, cha, cha with boom. Boom, cha, cha, boom, cha, cha, boom. Nice day for a quiet drive. Whoa! Attack of the bubbles! <laughs> That's right, Debo. Bubbles pop when you touch them. Hmm. Wonder, how do you make bubbles? Great idea! We'll follow the bubbles to find out. I'm gonna need wings. Wings confirmed. Activate Blippi Station. <laughs> Shrinky down! The Blippi Mobile is ready for adventure. The bubbles are from the car wash. Let's give it a wash. Hi. Oh, good boy. I'm Marvin, Marvin Bubbly. Hey, it's me, Blippi, and this is Debo. We're here to learn how to... Wait a second, are you a pop star? Oh. <laughs> sure am. My mom loves you! Thank you, thank you very much. You're far too kind. So, what are you here to learn? Ba-da-ba-da-dern! Debo and I are here to learn how bubbles are made. So glad you asked! The surfaces of bubbles are soft. Ooh, which makes them pop easily. That reminds me, we need more bubbles. And I know just the fella to show you how. Hmm, can you guess? It's me, Marvin Bubbly. Come on. <laughs> Whoopsies. The first step is to get water. Then we need some soap to mix with it. And shoo ba -da boop Voila! You make bubbles! And look how they float! Us bubbles can float like that because we're just air that's trapped inside a thin layer of soapy water! Whoa! So bubbles are made by blowing air into soap! That's right! Which reminds me... Let's make some more bubbles! And I know just a fella to show you how! It's you! It is me! Just dip your hands in the water Get them sized up on the soap Make a circle with your hands and blow! Whoa! It's bigger than you! Check this out! Catch me if you can! I've got new heights to reach! Keep flying high, Marvin! And thanks for helping me get the answer to my question. How are bubbles made? They're made when air gets trapped inside a thin layer of soapy water! Upload answer, Devo! <laughs> Bye-bye, Marvin! Bye-bye, Blippi! Bye-bye, everyone! Ta-da! That egg looks egg-tastic, Blippi! <laughs> Thanks, Mika! What should I paint on my next one? Wow! Hi! Huh? <laughs> Whoa! Catch that egg! Whoa! Hey, it's 
me, Blippi. And this is Mika and Debo. Oh. Hi there, Blippi. I'm Beanie the Jelly Bean. A super surprise is waiting for you when you find all the eggs. Are you ready for your first clue? It's a scavenger hunt. Hmm, I wonder. Can we find all the eggs that lead to the super surprise? <laughs> Here's your first clue. Who, <clears throat> When you want to bust out a silly dance, try this spot to spin and prance. Silly dance, spin and prance. Oh, I think I know just the spot. The theater. Hmm, but where's the next clue? <laughs> I think he wants us to join in. Hey, check out this loose board. Our second clue. Hi, I'm Cheep Cheep. I've got your next clue. <laughs> You've solved one clue for your Easter party, but you'll get even closer if you follow Do Re Mi Mi Mi. It's a musical clue! To the musical bridge! Stop! Oh, stop! <laughs> Try copying me! La, 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 la! Let's play along with Chi Chi! La, 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 la! It's working! Our third clue! Oh, no! We'll save you, little egg! Oh, here it is. Howdy, I'm Rocket, the fastest chocolate rabbit in these parts. Staying right here would be unwise. You gotta chase me to find your super surprise. <laughs> the chocolate chase is on! Whoa, look at Rocket go. You've almost got him, Debo. It's the super surprise! We did it! Debo, look out! Whoa! Wow! Now that's a super surprise! <laughs> Thanks, Beanie, Cheep Cheep, and Rocket for answering my question. We found our super surprise. The treat baskets. Upload answer, Debo. But I wonder, who hid all the eggs? Wow, Barry, you make painting look so fun. It is fun, Mika. Whoa! I want to try that. Hmm, not quite what I pictured in my head. That looks great, Blippi! Remember, there are no mistakes in art. It's Bowie! Oh, hey! How you doing, Blippi crew? Wow, rainbows are the coolest! We should paint a rainbow next! Oh, what a great idea! Hey, I love this guy! Hmm, I wonder, how do you paint a rainbow when you only have red, yellow, and blue? Oh, three colors is all we need! I'll be right back! Come on, Debo! <laughs> oh, uh, I gotta do a quick appearance in New Zealand, but I'll be back to check out your paintings! Bye-bye, Bowie! Wow! What's that? It's the Paint Mixer 5000! It's gonna help us make a rainbow! Are you ready, Debo? It's mixing time! Whoopsie! Wrong button! Oh, Debo, you're orange now. But how did red and yellow make orange? It's because red and yellow are primary colors, and blue too. When you mix two primary colors together, you make a secondary color, like green, orange, and purple. So cool. 
Next, let's make green. You got it. Debo, pour in the yellow and blue. New color coming up. Here we go. Here we go. Now all we need for the rainbow is my favorite color. Purple. Maybe if we mix red and blue. We haven't tried that yet. Now we just need to mix these together. And shake it up. <laughs> it's purple. <laughs> Yay! Let's go paint that rainbow. Why just paint a rainbow when you can experience a rainbow? Come on, let's go. Ready to experience a rainbow? Yeah! yeah. Hit it, Debo! Yeah! Surf's up! I love artistic expression! Oh, wow, we zip zoom bang! You made a full rainbow experience! I love it! I truly feel seen. <laughs> and I got the answer to my question How do you paint a rainbow with only red, yellow, and blue? You mix them to make orange, green, and purple. Upload answer, Debo. Let's party! Yahoo! Yeah. <laughs> Activate Flippy Station. It's time, get up and shout. I wonder what we'll learn about. Flippy Wonders! This is going to be the best English feast ever! I can't wait to make all my favorite foods from London, England. Uh-oh! Are you okay, Tabs? Whoa! Tabs, you look like a knight! Hmm, I wonder, what was it like to be a knight in shining armor? Great idea, Tabs. We can go back in time to medieval London and find out. <laughs> Going back in time! Halt! Who goes there? Hey, it's me, Flippy. And this is Tabs. Are you a knight? Sir Buttercup, loyal knight of Her Majesty's kennel. So cool! Can you show us what a knight does? Of course! I was just about to test the castle's defense system, which helps keep it safe. My counterpart, Sir Pudding, will be assisting. All right! Fire when ready! Whoa! Was that a tomato? Probably! The catapults are loaded with rotten fruit to fire at anyone who approaches the castle! Take cover! Look out! Oh. Who turned out the lights? <gasps> Are you okay? Yes! My armor is made of steel and can protect me from the most severe of boo-boos. Good job, Sir Pudding! <laughs> For this next test, we will need to be very careful. Follow me! <laughs> Slowly now, the moat is filled with terrible oh. creatures so that intruders can't get across. Oh, terrible creatures? They could attack at any moment. <laughs> you mean the little ducks? Oh, yes. <laughs> Whoa! Yikes! Mmm, <laughs> a doggy dish. Sir Pudding must be hungry. But how can we get inside? The castle walls are built very high to keep intruders out. I've got an idea. Follow me. I'm gonna need wings. Wings confirmed. English feast! I can see why you were protecting the castle. 
Oh, Sir Pudding, what a wonderful idea. Thank you for your help. I declare you Sir Blippy and Lady Tabs. Wow, what an honor. And I got the answer to my question. What was it like to be a knight in shining armor? It was awesome! Knights protected their castle and kept everyone safe. Upload answer tabs. Farewell! Bye bye Sir Buttercup! Land ho! Treasure first mate, Debo. <laughs> I love playing pirates. Yar, me too. What is it, Debo? <laughs> Whoa! Wow! It's a treasure map. Hmm, I wonder. How do you find buried treasure? I can help. X is where the treasure is buried. So cool! But how do we get to the X? First, we need to figure out where we are. Do you see anything you recognize from the map? Hey! That elephant-shaped rock looks just like the one on the map. Now you see those dashes? According to the map's scale, each dash is equal to one step. Hmm, there's five dashes, so that's five steps. Right! Huh? And according to my compass watch, we need to walk five steps north, which is this way. One, two, three, four, five. The map says we need to climb up the tree. How are we gonna do that? Look, a rope ladder. Nice work, first mate Debo. Treasure, here we come! Whoa! A secret door! But how do we open it? Hmm, this hopscotch grid is on the map. <gasps> I've got it! Blippi, try hopping only on the blue squares. All right! We did it! Let's go! Whee! X marks the spot! <laughs> And I got the answer to my question. How do you find buried treasure? To find buried treasure, you need a map. And to follow the directions written on it to find the X. Upload answer, Debo. Let's see what's inside. The Great Big Book of Curiosity? Whoa! What a curious kind of treasure. Huh? They. Let's go find out. <laughs> nice catch, Debo. Do you hear that? That's one cool beat. I can't stop moving. <laughs> Hmm, I wonder, why does music make us want to dance? Hi, Blippi. Hi, Mika. Hey, Benjamin. That was some pretty sweet beatboxing you were doing. Yeah, it made me want to dance. Hey, Benjamin, do you know why music makes us want to move our bodies and dance? I sure do. Just shrink down to my size and I'll show you. All right. Shrinking down! Ah, 
awesome. Now we're ready to party. Yeah! Hit it, DJ D-Bops! When we hear music, we enjoy the sound of it. This beat makes me want to move my feet. I love this song. And our bodies want to explain how the noise is being made. So we move in a way that matches the rhythm. On the beat. Woo! A classical song. Love your moves, Blippi. Check out yours, Mika. <laughs> now we've got the same moves. Together. Woohoo! Hey, DJ D Bops, pick up that tempo! Flippy, I challenge you to a dance off! It's on! Dance on! Go, Flippy! Go, Flippy! Break it down, Mika! a nice ring. It makes me wanna sing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I almost forgot one more thing about dancing. What is it? That it's super fun. Oh, yeah. It's a blast. <laughs> Thanks for answering my question, Benjamin. Music makes us want to dance because our bodies want to match the beat it's a great way to connect with friends, and it's so much fun! Upload answer, Debo. <laughs> Who's ready for a dance-off? Round two. <laughs> it's on! Dance on! <laughs> Woo! Yeah! Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> Fetch, Debo. Whoa! I should have built a bigger moat. Huh? Sorry about your castle, Krabby. Oh, it's okay. There's plenty of sand to rebuild it. Good question, Debo. Hmm, I wonder, where does sand come from? To answer that, you'll have to go to the top of Mount Peaky. To the top of Mount Peaky we go. I'm gonna need wings and frog legs. Wings, frog legs, confirm. The Blippi Mobile is ready for adventure. Whoa! <sighs> hey, it's me, Blippi, and this is Debo. Hey there, I'm Wayne the Boulder. I just woke up from the best dream. I was a grain of sand living atop a sand castle in a beach paradise. That's so cool. And I want to make my dream a reality. <laughs> Erosion is a process that usually takes millions of years. But let me break it down for you. Cannonball! Whee! <laughs> <laughs> Look, I'm already smaller. Erosion usually takes so long, but I'm feeling ambitious today. Yeah, let's go. Activate propeller. Propeller confirmed. <laughs> I'm having a lot of fun, Blippi. Me too. Whirlpool. Whoa. Erosion makes me dizzy. Water slowly breaks down rocky surfaces, but this whirlpool is really speeding things up. Activate Turbo Booster. <laughs> Whoa! Yeah! Whoa, look how small I am. Shrinking down. Wow, Wayne, you're so small we can barely keep up. Here's the secret to keeping up. You gotta... Whoa! Whoa. Catch that thing! 
Sheesh! Whoa, Wayne! You're tiny! Yup, <laughs> even fish play a part in the process of erosion. Now let's go find my dream castle! Whoa! Oh boy, here we go! Ah, there! My sand castle's complete! Ha! I did it! My dream came true! Thanks for being a gem during my erosion! It was a blast! And I got the answer to my question. Where does sand come from? Sand comes from big boulders as they break into smaller pieces through a process called erosion, which usually takes millions of years. Upload answer, Debo. Bye bye Goodbye! See you later!